All right, so I just um, started building up another toolbox type thing. I'm going to actually put this one probably in my basement. And I just wanted to kind of, I was in the middle of doing it, and I thought, well, why not just take a couple minutes here and record it? So what I've got here is this um, is just some old bed frame that somebody was throwing out around by me, and I snagged it a while back, and I kind of just been holding on to it and just extra angle iron it's you know already powder coated so that's pretty nice um just kind of cut up the ends here and tack welded everything together i always put a little washer in between that and the actual case for a little space there so you can get it back on and off and uh um just got some leftover pieces down there you know um and this again is just i had the bigger box uh, that I did over in the corner um, and then I just decided to go ahead and do this one too this is going to be the bottom frame I'm putting it on the top here just because it's upright and when I'm done I'll put some wheel casters on here and uh, then I'll put it on the bottom after I flip it around but right now I'm just gonna finish welding this up I just tacked it up a little bit right now and uh, now I'm getting ready to do the final welding so I thought I'd just pause here and then um, I'll try to maybe show the ending here with the wheels and everything together and you know what's really nice about this is it's just a big steel drawer and you can fit huge stuff in there you know you can put in a grinder you can put in all kinds of big pneumatic tools and you can pad this up and it just you know makes for really good sturdy storage it's nice steel i got this given to me for nothing um somebody just didn't want it near me and uh so then it's just something that if you're looking to expand your toolbox capacity and you don't want to put up a a big metal shelf uh or even a little metal shelf you know you can put wheels on this thing you can move it around the garage or move it around your basement um and then it just makes for great storage so yeah i'll just you know once i have the wheels on here and everything else together i'll Try to show up the final part. All right, so just got done doing the little welding on these little wheels. I put four wheels on top. I probably should have protected the top of the cabinet a little better, but anyway, I got the wheels welded on and uh, got one with a lock. I always want to get casters that swivel with one with so you can lock it from rolling away from you. Anyway, this piece here is on the top. It's fitted, and uh, I'm going to throw it on the bottom, and we can have a look at rolling it around. Okay, so there it is. Got the uh, top here. Got the wheels on the bottom. Little caster swiveling. Even have the one off to the side if I want to lock it. Can just push down a little lock there, and then ain't going nowhere. So if you're looking for some good storage, you know the uh, the old. Filing cabinet system that nobody wants anymore is a great candidate. Give it a try. It holds a lot of stuff. Okay, and just to demonstrate it, I kind of put some stuff in here. And this is the first shelf. I don't have these, like, you know, filled up all the way, but you can look inside these cabinets. They lock, too. You can put all this stuff in here. Strong steel sturdiness to hold everything. Same thing all the way to the bottom. I can even put more stuff in there. But anyway, uh, another person kind of gave me this idea on YouTube, so I thought I'd share along how it worked out for me.